Hi everyone. In this video, I will show you one error and then we will solve that uh, error uh, which is coming in a WordPress uh, hosting. So let's get started. Uh, so as you can see, this is my website, thecodespace.in and recently I have changed my hosting from another provider to Hostemble. So I had to migrate all the things uh, manually. So I have done that thing, but uh, like as you can see, this is my home page of my website. If I will click on this, then as you can see, I'm getting 404 uh, not found. Okay. And uh, if I will click on some another links, let's say I'll click on this link. Then as you can see, we are getting the same thing on and every, every link, uh, which is in this home page. Okay. So now, uh, the thing is now we will fix this issue which is coming from uh, like uh, our uh, WordPress uh, uh, code okay so now we need to do some changes and then we can fix our issue so first uh, you need to go into your file manager so in your C panel click on this file manager and then here as you can see here we have public underscore HTML so click on this folder and here like uh, you will get this dot uh, file if you are not able to see this file uh, then you can click on this settings and here you can just uh, check this show hidden files button and then you can see this uh, file or else if you don't have file here then you can create just uh, that file here dot access okay now just uh, edit this file so here I'll just edit this and uh, currently I'm having blank file. So I, what I'll do, I'll just go in, in a, uh, in a uh, internet and I'll just uh, type uh, wp.stxs uh, file. Okay. So I'll just click on this first link of WordPress. So here it will uh, have the base code which we need to use. So I'll just copy this base code for that stxx file and uh, here I'll just paste that okay so I'll just paste that code and I'll just do save changes okay uh, click on okay so this file uh, will be overwritten and uh, now uh, I'll just go back to my website I'll just refresh my website and uh, now if I'll click on any link let's say I'll click on this uh, continue reading then as you can see now we got our page uh, back so yeah we can also go in another links let's say i'll go, go in this link so as you can see we got our uh, like uh, all data back into our website page so yeah that was the quick fix for this uh, i hope you understood if you did then please do subscribe my channel i will put more troubleshooting shooting related videos in the future so keep uh, tune with me thank you i'll see you in the next video till then keep sharing keep loving bye